Hey guys, welcome back to <clears throat> another episode in the deep playthrough of Resident Evil 7. I am in the middle of the working week, but decided to sneak in one quick episode anyways. Not that that is something I rarely do. Holy shit, what's that flickering? Ah, is this where I have to go now? Get the searing ingredients from Lucas. That door is still locked. Anyways, it's not like I never played during the work week, but this week I really didn't get around to it a lot. What the holy hell is this? I really have to actually find my bearings again. It's, controls are not that difficult to get a grip with again, but still. I do think there will be molded in the house currently, and even a, a, a new type of molded, a four legged one. So let's see what I have with me. Not that much. 30 handgun bullets. Find the deputy's body in the dissection room. That's where we need to go. All right, I do have some flames. Let's just see what we will be up against. Somehow, I think there will be molded. What was this door again? Yes, this is molded territory. We need to get to the dissection room. And where the hell was that again? Probably downstairs. Yes, I need to. Hmm, it's quite. Quite complicated to see in the sense that there are a lot of stairs here. I'm not sure whether they get up to the next level. I don't think so. I think they all remain level B1. Because over here there are not that many stairs. And the stairs that are here, for instance, in the main hall, that actually go up to 2F, from 1F to 2F, not from 1F to B1. So I think I will just make take that big stairs over there to the basement and then to the incinerator room. I do think I might... be greeted by molded or this room actually already was molded it's not like it grew since returning to the house all right i am just saving the game just to be sure And the room to the basement actually was um, open. So Lucas probably went down here and of course in the basement there initially were quite some molded. So that probably won't be anything different now, which I actually don't really like because 
I find them more annoying than anything else. We need to get to the dissection room. And I think that means making our way through the boiler room to the dissection room. So let's just go over here. Right. Have to get the other way. Is it more molded than it used to be? I wonder. This is where... No, it's not like there were more molded here. I wonder whether this is the quickest way. I'm now going all the way through these hallways. I think there used to be like a shortcut doorway, but I don't really see it. Whatever. Molded, please stay the hell away. Because you're freaking annoying. thing is they can also come from everywhere they can just fall from the ceiling freaky grandma yes that's pretty freaky hopefully it means there won't be any new molded here. And I wonder whether I have to fight her at one point in time. Is she still there? Yes. And she's also like looking in my direction. I wonder if I look at her from the other side. No, then she's not looking in my direction. Pretty darn freaky. It's probably seen a lot of crazy shit. I personally really don't like cellars that much basements in horror houses holy shit that was a new one is it that yes mother sucker mother sucker i don't really think I could avoid it, this one. Maybe I could, because I do think there are challenge runs in games like these without taking any damage. All right, I'm spending a med kit. Holy shit, this is all molded out suddenly. Let's first check out upstairs. Annoying molded. Ah, that's, I think, um, whose body were we looking for? The deputy's body. I think he might have turned as well, that it will be like a kind of a boss fight, or I'm not really sure whether it's a deputy's body, because there are also bodies over there. Ah, I remember the deputy body, the deputy's body, 
was down in that room over here. Or at least somewhere over here. Nice utensils. Tools of torture. Then his body was... Where was it again? Maybe over here? Here he is. Prove you're a real man, stick your hand down this pig's throat. Ah, that's what he meant with pig. I'm actually getting a bit accustomed to all those eerie sounds. I'm not sure whether that's a good thing, but here we go. There's a sickly switch tense. He started rotting already. Rigor mortis must have set in, his joints are already stiff. It could very well be that he becomes a molded, I guess. Prove you're a real man, stick your hands ah, down no. this pig's throat. Yes, this is really gross. I think we get the snakey. Yes. Good guess. That pretty little thing will help you find the two key cards you're gonna need to join the party we're having over here. You've gotta earn your way, Ethan. Alright, but this is actually a good thing because. This is why I hate them so much. I don't even have any bullets anymore. I have to lure them. Freaking annoying. Alright, you know what? Freaking annoying. And a waste of flamer fuel. I even hear more of them. And I only have a bit of flamer fuel left. the hell was that snake door over here man the thing is those molded in my view they are just annoying they're not fun I hear more of them. I also heard like a Mr. Everywhere.
All right, where the hell are we now? Ah, over here. The workshop door is closed. Maybe I could try and see to open that, but first I'd like to have some more ammunition with all these molded over here. Because I'm pretty sure I've not seen the last of them. That's what I mean. Ah, fuck this shit, baby, people. This is not fun at all. Ah, uh, screw it. I thought that actually... The, um... Opening up the map... would um, stop the game, but actually it doesn't. All right, this was really a bummer. Annoying and a bummer. But I'm not gonna replay it. I don't think I could open up that workshop over there. I tried it while running away from that last mullet. I, I don't think it was like, um, a snake key door but there are quite some other snake key doors in here like the master bedroom over there i thought there was way more let's check it out like the that other house Man, that's so weird. Seems to be only one snake key door. Yeah, or two counting the one in the basement we just opened. Ah, no, there are two here. There's one in the kids room and one in the master bedroom. So that is all uh, at the top floor of the house. Let's first dish the burner. And let's see about some ammunition. Do I have anything? Yeah, I do have some gunpowder. Here is handgun ammo. And yeah, that's about it. Separation agent is not really helping as I do not have that much items that I can separate, but I could use some gunpowder. And maybe even two. Let's see how many you can combine with one pack of camp paste. Ah, it's only one. Um, I am hurt already also. So maybe I could just eat one herb, although it is a waste, but what to do I'm pretty hurt right check out my screen I think I'm just gonna take a full medicine why not here we go steady 
Save the game. And check the time. Four minutes left. All right, guys, there will uh, probably the next uh, safe opportunity will be way later than four minutes because I'm going to go upstairs and there I will probably be um, harassed and stuff. So um, I am going to end the episode here and continue in the next one. Uh, also, because it's already quite late in the middle of the working week. So I have to call it a night, unfortunately. I do am slowly actually getting into the game and would like to continue, but yeah, it is what it is. Um, by the way, on a side note, I saw the trailer of Resident Evil 3. Look really cool. Unfortunately, it's only coming out in April 220, so still almost uh, four or five months away. Um, and it's of course third person view, I guess. And I really dig first person view way, way more. But yeah, it's a remake, so they have to uh, stick a bit with the original concepts. Um, but that's like super cool. That's for next year on the uh, playthrough agenda. Um, first, let's get um, unscathed through this Resident Evil 7 deep playthrough. Pre avoiding having a heart attack. Um, so, and continue that in the next episode. Guys, hope you enjoyed. If you did, please leave a like, a share, or maybe even a subscribe. And hope to see you in the next one. And for the meantime, do not forget to always do keep on gaming. See you later.